68 years later wife finds out why her husband vanished Peggy seal when Peggy graduated from high school World War II was in full swing on the other side of the world she decided that she should do something to help so she left her home in Vernon Texas she traveled to Atlas Air Base in Oklahoma there she started working as an electrical mechanic for various instruments she was the only female mechanic on the base so she caught the attention of many men on the base a general's son one of the men that was impressed by Peggy was one of the generals on the base he suggested that Peggy write to his son Billy Harris she felt strange writing to someone that she didn't know and she let the general know shortly after she got a letter from Billy through his father Peggy was hesitant to answer at first but she finally did her idea was to dissuade him from wanting a relationship with her convincing Peggy Peggy didn't think that she and Billy would ever have a future together she told him that she loved opera and she listened to it on Saturday afternoons she was sure that that would turn him off but he wrote back next she wrote to him that she memorized poetry and he wrote back saying that he did as well every time Peggy told him something that she was sure would turn him off it made him like her even more finally she gave in a bit and agreed to meet with him when he came to visit his father she didn't expect too much and she told him not to expect too much either soulmates when the two met in person they knew immediately that they were soulmates their courtship lasted for months and soon they were engaged they didn't have a long engagement and in 1943 they got married Shortly after getting married, they found out that Billy was being transferred to Florida and from there he'd be shipped out to Europe. Peggy traveled to Florida so that she could spend as much time as possible with her new husband. Called early. When the Germans shot down a plane of aviator pilots, Billy was called to Europe early. When they said goodbye to one another, Peggy realized that it could have been the last time they would see one another. When he left, Peggy was sent back to Texas. She was told that she couldn't reveal where her husband was because there were spies all over the US trying to find out where the pilots were being sent. Billy's missions. When Billy was stationed in the UK, he flew in between 60 and 100 successful missions. Due to the number of missions he completed, he was allowed to head home. He couldn't wait to get back to his wife. While waiting for his boat, he was told that the wounded soldiers had first priority and there was no room for him. He'd have to wait. He tried to stay positive knowing that he'd be home soon. He wrote a letter to Peggy to let her know about the delay. Another mission. Billy decided that he couldn't just sit around and wait for the next boat, so he offered to go on another mission. Peggy was home waiting for her husband, and when months passed with no word, she was anxious. She finally heard from the Supreme Headquarters Allied Expeditionary Force, and they told her that Billy had returned to the United States. She was thrilled. Finally, she'd be reunited with her husband. When weeks turned to months, panic set in. Searching Peggy and Billy's father were very worried about Billy. They worried that he was sent back to the U.S. seriously wounded and lost his memory. They reached out to the Red Cross, who started an investigation to his whereabouts. She received a letter saying that Billy was missing in action, dated July 7th. She thought something was strange because she received a letter from Billy on the same day refusing to give up Peggy refused to give up on her husband for years she hoped that somehow he was alive somewhere when speaking to CBS News about the ordeal she said Billy was married to me all of his life and I choose to be married to him all of my life this was the reason why she never remarried answers Peggy and Billy's cousin Alton wouldn't stop searching for Billy they check the Arlington National Cemetery archives where they're told that it could take up to six weeks to get a reply a few weeks later Peggy got a phone call she found out that a French woman from Levente France had also requested records Peggy wanted to find out who the woman was and she finally got her answers the woman who sought the records was the mayor of the town because there he was considered a hero she found out that Billy had saved countless lives in the city before his plane was shot down they were having a parade in his honor and they asked Peggy to attend check out these other videos from let me know if you haven't made the move to subscribe to our channel all you need to do is click on that red subscribe button thank you for watching